I can't say final match because it's not the final it's match. Not it's not final. the main event. Well, but the we main do event. have an intermission following the, the, this match. The main, the main event, the main event. Is last, but this is the match what you're you looking for. Yes, you are correct in that. This is the match I've been looking forward to because this has a lot of implications going into this matchup. Oh, absolutely. A lot riding on the line between these three, these three uh, performers, these three wrestlers, the talent, the sheer talent in this ring is going to be unprecedented. That's got to be Clay. That's got to be Clay. What makes you say that? That's fair. I rest my case. Fair enough. Crispy I'm Clay still, Drasher. I'm still coming down after that exciting matchup we just saw with Sammy Pandora, so my brain's a little all over the place at the moment. Nevertheless, big implications going into this matchup. Work rate entertainment, heavyweight championship qualifying triple threat match. Well, yeah, we got Cody Adams versus Crispy Clay Drasher. Versus the tra Trojan Horn? Trajan, tra tra Trajan, Trajan Horn. Trajan. Oh, Trajan Horn, excuse me. My notes are a little I mean, uh, silhouetted, I, so it's hard to read. So sometimes I don't. Uh, oh, it's better whoa. not to ask. Oh. Clay got in a little. Uh, got Clay, Clay a little straight heated. In. Well, he just came out of the air fryer, you know, so he's a little crispy. Trajan Horn. I'm kind of surprised you've got nothing to say about this. It's not very often I'm rendered speechless, Adam. I've noticed. This is one of those times that I'm rendered speechless. However, I'd like to know where he, um, I mean, first of all, the dude's got more rolls than a bakery, and I'd like to know where he found a size 68 extra fat in a pair of spandex, because... Fan favorite. Jersey Shore, Pennsylvania. Can you get more white trash in the same Come sentence, on. seriously? Come on. I mean, honestly. Fan favorite coming out here. That is Cody awful. Adams. I didn't even know there was a Jersey Shore, Pennsylvania. Like I have to admit, neither did I. Like, it's But listen, that's where Cody Adams is look from, into and he's a I fan a favorite, so I mean. I think that's, that's seriously got to be fake news. There's no way there's a town called Jersey Shore, PA. Nevertheless, all the athleticism of Cody Adams. Well, again, he, uh, another one of our martial arts experts here in work entertainment. He we is a black a belt in jujitsu. But um, I'm, uh, I'm a little, I'm still a little flabbergasted by this. Um, Trajan Horn? Sure. Yeah. Um, dude looks like a fugitive from the funny papers. Where do you come up with this stuff? Let's see, Krispy Clay. Oh! Not Krispy Kreme, because Krispy Kreme donuts are so good. Oh! We won't go there, but Krispy Kreme donuts. Yeah, Krispy Clay Drasha, Krispy Clay. Again, he was uh, definitely a part of a, a, a renowned tag team back in the day. Decided to uh, go solo. Has had a very successful uh, individual solo career as well. And right now, but the now, way things are looking, it looks now like he should have brought his tag team partner as he's getting double teamed here by Cody Adams and Trajan Horn. Well, it's a thing here. It's being that the fact that this is a work rate entertainment heavyweight championship tournament qualifying oh. match, there are no friends here. 
It is you are act, you one are fall right. to a finish, winner take all. You winner goes on, losers go home crying, and there is a lot at stake here. I mean, you, you're qualifying for oh. most, the most prestigious titles in our industry today. And I'll tell you what, Cody Adams, he came to play. But I'll tell you what, so did Trajan Horner. I have never seen a man of that size do a drop kick like that before. Now that's impressive. Oh, big European uppercut. I can finally say that now, because I mean, we don't have Wyndham out this here. This man can't even run a 100-yard dash in a weekend is amazing. Oh, beautiful maneuver he did from a Trajan Horn. I wanna, I'm going to clap for that. Holy Moses. I would not have guessed of the two men in the ring that Trajan Horn would have the same level of, of athleticism I would have expected Cody Adams to have, but he is by far surpassing my expectations. Oh. Well, Cody, Cody Adams actually slipped a little bit there on that middle rope, yeah, going for like a springboard plancha. And I'll tell you what, that was, I mean, that definitely could cost him in this match, but I'll tell you, Very Crispy well. Clay could taking the advantage of the mistake of Cody Adams and going for what could have been a quick three count here and going home the winner was very smart on the part of Crispy Clay. I mean. Big shot to the gut from Crispy Clay. That's right, Chris, Crispy Clay. A bit of a tongue twister. It is, isn't it? But Clay again. now looks like he's got a bit of a headlock. He's raking his face across the rope. But in a triple threat match, there are no disqualifications. So I mean, absolutely, referee Adam. really can't do too much but yell at the guy. He, he, he can't. There is no disqualification. There is no count. There has to be a winner by via pinfall or submission. You know, we have to know who is moving on in this in this tournament. And this is with the in this qualifying match. Who's, who's going to get their shot at the work rate entertainment world championship? And uh, referee Trajan Horn has just telling him it's only a two. Trajan Horn has been pretty much subtracted from this match. It's a lot of subtraction. I mean, he had to take a moment to catch his breath. Clay Drasher, crispy Clay Drasher, having all the momentum as Cody Adams starts firing back. Somebody get him a, get him a respirator here. Whew. Setting up and oh, beautiful belly to back suplex there by Clay Drasher and Cody Adams. Oh, here comes Trajan Horn crawling back into the ring. There's oh, he's got Clay broke the pin. He got a German and a release German suplex at that. The sheer power of, of Trajan Trajan Horn. Trajan Horn, yes. Talk about, talk about a tongue twister right there. It's hard to say a few times fast. Oh, big clothesline in the corner. I, I mean, he better uh, do a little more dancing than wrestling oh, there. Using the ropes to his advantage, coming in with another European out there cut. Almost trying to take Clay's head off of that clothesline in the corner. Chucks him in the ropes and, oh, back breaker. Into a standing takeout. Two. Oh, Cody Adams barely in to break up that pin. Barely getting in there, still getting in there, keeping this match alive and his hopes and dreams alive and moving on in this matchup. We talked about, we've been talking about since this match first started, the World Championship implications. Now Trajan Horn and Cody Adams. Braden shots. Well, Clay now trying to get his own in. Off the rope. Oh, big knee strike. Turning. Trajan inside out. Cody Adams coming in with a roll up. Two, three. It's over. Yeah, did he get it? He got him. Cody Adams Co pins up the victory. I'll tell you what, I want to definitely, I want to see the replay on that because Clay Drasher said he got his left shoulder up, and I'll tell you what, I agree with him. I think the ref cheated him right here. The ref cheated Clay Drasher, and this is what I'm telling you about these these uh, these non-union refs that we hire here right off the street, straight out of Dollar General, you know, with these 80 cent man buns and everything like that from the holiday air. Clay Drasher is 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 more upset than a gerbil in a bathhouse at this moment because I'm telling you, he got cheated. I'm telling you, I saw that left shoulder up and the ref still kept counting. The ref cheated. Crispy Clay Drasher out of shot and moving on in this tournament and gave Cody Adams a tainted victory. I want a ruling out here. I, I want I want our general manager, I want our president, our owner. I want a two-year investigation. There was collusion in that match. All right, all right. Well, we're about to go into an intermission here, so maybe Why we can go in the back, talk to that referee. I'm gonna get find to the out what happened. 